Hey guys, welcome and welcome back. Oh my gosh, where's my AirPod? I found it. But jumping right into the video like normal. Hmm. Lately, I should say. But anyway, I did my ball cap, then I put my two layers of glue. I don't know if I put one or two, but if you want your wig to last, put more than two, put more than three, put four or five. It doesn't matter. It depends on how long you want your wig to last, but don't OD because your wig is going to be stuck and then the glue gets dirty. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, I put my glue down, then I put my lace on top of my glue and then I use the elastic band. I wouldn't call this a melt. I wouldn't say I'm melting. I'm just trying to make the lace stick to the glue. I'm not really melting right now. Okay, but on to me hot combing. I use my slick stick and I'm not really sure the name of the brand, but like I'm going to start putting all the products that I use in the description because you guys do always ask and I never really remember the names off the top of my head when I see the comments. So I just don't respond, but I'm going to start putting it into the description box. So yeah, just read that if you want to know what kind of slick stick it is. And my hot comb is from Locked Lace. I think that's the company's name. Locked Lace, they sent me glue and they sent me that hot comb. It gets so hot, it gets to 500 degrees. And y'all always ask me, how's your wig so flat? That hot comb. It's not even that hot comb only, but the hot comb. <laughs> Okay, she's giving scalp. Now we're taking our little baby scissors and we're going to cut the lace in a zigzag motion. I've seen people on TikTok use the craft scissors, but I just can't seem to want to get my hands on those. So I just do it manually. I just zigzag. And technically, this is how I've always been doing it. I just have not been making like precise lines like I am now. So yes, that's how you want to cut your lace because straight lines when you cut your lace are more visible to the human eye than zigzag curvy lines are so you want to aim for doing that instead of just a straight line across Oh my gosh, just get into the melt, like in the widow's peak. Ah, uh, I literally ate that down. I'm gonna try to curl the hair. I'm not sure how good I'm gonna be at that. And I know it's a little orange, but it's on me because I don't have any toner. And did. But I'm just gonna curl this front of my hair first. Like I said, just to see if I'm given what it's supposed to be given. And it's the same exact curl I she used to, but this is my boyfriend's sister. It's not even mine. Okay, so y'all see, this is the first curl we got. I'm gonna let her sit for a second before I really comb her out. Okay. Okay, I already don't like it. I already don't like it. Um. We're gonna curl the whole half and see where we land after that.
Y'all, I need to get a new setup because this one isn't working just because like I can't face forward to my camera and do my hair all the time. Like half the time I do my hair, I have to be facing that way because that's where the mirror is. But like times like this, when I'm recording a YouTube video, I need to be able to face forward so y'all can see what I'm doing. So maybe I just need a new setup and to like put my um, mirror in a different spot so I can look straight and not to the side. But I don't know how I'm gonna get that to happen. So we're gonna keep thinking. But yeah, I definitely need a new setup. Definitely need to get that together. I'll see what I can do. Ooh. I know y'all at home watching like, girl, that is not how you're supposed to be doing it. But I don't know how to do it. And I don't know how to get this camera to not look so contrast. I don't know what the word is, but it just looks like y'all are staring right at me with the brightest light on me ever. All right, let me do this last two pieces, I assume this is the yeah. I'll put some more this one. So yeah, I don't know. I just feel like me looking off to the side is just not good for you guys because you guys can't really see me too much. I say I can, I don't know. Just let me know what y'all think in the comments about my setup. I think personally that I need a new setup. So, not for TikTok though. Like, I feel like this setup is perfect for TikTok, but not YouTube videos. And I need to find something that's perfect for both. Cause see, look, I go like this. And y'all can't even see what I'm doing. Because I'm covering the camera with my big ass arm. So, we're gonna figure something out, my baby. I'm, I feel like I'm gonna go on the floor, but I don't know. Cause even like, when I'm not home and I'm doing my hair, it's just like, why are you on the floor? Why are you on the floor? I don't know, like I just, it's not a problem. You feel me being on the floor? There's no really like, big issue with it. So, I don't be mind it. But people be concerned about me. So, we'll see how the floor setup works. Again, because I already had a floor setup, mind y'all. I already had a floor setup. But the thing is, with the floor setup that I had, I moved my bed. So, now I can't go back to that exact setup. And that setup was chef's kiss. It was good. I won't even cap to y'all, it was good. Okay, so look at my hair. Spray one more time. Now I'm gonna comb through it with my fingers because my white tooth comb is in the bathroom. Man, who's going to go get that? Cause it won't be me. I'm not mad at it. My thing is, is the front. So I'm gonna try to layer that some more, but right here, it's getting beautiful. I love her. Cause I don't wanna be cutting this shit for no reason now. And that's exactly what the issue was, hold on. Let me get into it real fast. My problem is I'm scared to cut the hair like so much and I think that's why I can't get it perfect because I'm just moving too scary. And maybe I just need to stop moving so scary. Cause girl, I'm looking good. Ouch. 
burn my finger for that one. why you guys can't see it well on camera like i said i don't know what i'm doing with this camera business but i feel like y'all cannot see it good on camera i feel like it just looks like hair and i don't like that i'm gonna test out the other side see how we're doing hopefully it's just not bad okay No, it looks good. I'm gonna enter some clips and stuff of how the hair looks for real because y'all, this shit looks weird on camera, bro. It looks fucking weird. On this side, I curled this the wrong way, so now it's like going the wrong way. I'm gonna dry a bit. Hold on, like I said, dry. Whoa, bitch. Maybe it's the band throwing me off. Y'all think maybe it's the band that's throwing me off? I don't know. I should get rid of it and see. I like messy curls. Like, that's what I really look like. It looks good, y'all. But yes. Here she is. I'm gonna add some baby hairs, of course, of course, but I'll see you guys in the morning for that part because it is a good time right now, y'all. 2.47, if I'm lying, I'm dying. Look at her. But now, bro, it's three o'clock in the morning, basically. And I'm gonna tie her down. Let's just do a quick zoom test. I'm gonna tie her down and I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Don't mind my background. I'm not home. Or my shirt. You wanna say something? You already know what I'm saying. But I'm editing my video and I just realized I didn't record an outro. Don't beat me up. Don't beat me up. I just, I'm terrible at recording intro, outros. Like, I record my videos and I'd be like, oh, I'm done my hair. Bye. Like, girl. So don't mind that. I would do better. Um, Did y'all like the video though? You guys can't see it well on camera. Like Did I like the video though? I don't. Like I don't. Because I'm on this fucking like phone right now. She looks good. Okay. Okay. Bye y'all.